Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 2021 Notorious Open Draft. We are your panel. I'm Jacob and I'll be representing Team One. Hello everybody, I'm Gerardo Sr. and I will be representing Team Two. Hi everyone, I'm Joy. I'm actually representing Team One with Jacob, but today I'm standing in to represent Team Four. I'm Jordan Jr. and I'm representing Team Three. And I'm Alex and I'll also be representing Team Three. And the purpose of today is to split everyone in the gym into four teams. So that way we can take a more community approach to the Open this year. Okay, so let's talk about the Open and what it is. The Open is a worldwide competition designed by CrossFit HQ to give everyone a chance to see where they rank amongst the CrossFit community. On top of that, it is also a way to kind of filter through the CrossFit community and decide who gets to go to regionals and from there decide who gets to go to the games. Previously, the Open used to be a five week long period where every week there would be a different workout, but this year it is gonna be three weeks long. And then if you are in the top 10% after those three weeks, you go into two more weeks of the Open to see who qualifies for the next step. To register for this global competition, you can go to games.crossfit.com to be a part of that global competition and before we get into the specifics of the Notorious Open, I just want to open, <laughs> open <laughs> this discussion to our panel to see what have some of your Opens look like. Uh, well, in my experience, I think that uh, it's really fun, especially because I get to do it with the community, with the kids, and it's always kind of put me in check as far as uh, trying to keep up with everybody. So it's just it's just a ton of fun for me. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah. For me, um, I really like the camaraderie. Um, I just love how everyone gets to cheer everyone on. And this is like the time to really push yourself and get your first, right? I've seen a lot of people get their first muscle ups, ring muscle ups, handstand push ups. So it's a really cool time to um, get some PRs. Yeah. Yeah, like going off with what Joy said, it's a great time too. To like have everybody just all men, even though, yes, we'll be on the team and all that good stuff. We're all doing it together. It's just so much fun. Going based off what Joyce said too, it's crazy to see what you can do when people cheer you on. Like that Perry Barbell, next thing you know, you're lifting it up. Like no problem. So yeah, for me. Yeah, what makes the Open special is the fact that it's uh, it, it kind of brings that competition mindset and that competition setting to you know the gym here. So if you're not comfortable doing competitions outside the gym, or you're not getting that, you're not fulfilling that uh, need to compete in a sport, uh, this is a good way to kind of tap back into that and. Know, test your profit abilities, test your skills, see where you are, you know, uh, nail right in the head. Like you said, this is a lot of time that you have, you know, first for everything, but at the same time, now that all of this is being released and you know that the open is coming up, you should take into account your training and what you've maybe uh, neglected or, or tried to scale or, or didn't, you know, you haven't been working on, and maybe use this time to try to hack away at those skills because I guarantee you, more likely than not, they will come up during the open and your ability to do those skills can separate you from a bunch of people. Yeah, and I think, you know, a common theme amongst everything that y'all shared is that it's a, it's a time for everyone to come in and like be together basically and work out together and push together and, and push doesn't matter what level you're at, you know, whether you can do a, overhead squat or bring muscle up or you're you know doing banding pull-ups or jumping pull-ups like everyone's there to push you no matter what level you're at so it's really cool to see you know the guy who can back squat 400 pounds cheering on the person who could back squat the bar or like 10 pounds on each side right and see them feel accepted in this uh, you know community and competitive setting so uh, super excited to see what comes out of this year especially with the new format from HQ so yeah I think it's gonna be really exciting especially given that everything that has been going on for the last you know 16 months uh, and it's just a good time to have something where we are just cheering on competing you know, that community and think that the open it's, it's a really good time for CrossFit 
All right, well, let's take a quick break and then uh, we'll go into the Notorious Open. Hey guys, just again, a quick reminder, you know, with our inclement weather, just make sure that you're bringing an extra pair of shoes when you're coming to the gym. Um, there are trays and mats over here to get the snow and the wetness off. So please make sure you leave your boots and extra shoes at the door and then change into your shoes when you get in. <laughs> All right, everyone. Now it's time to talk about the Notorious Open. All right, so this year we will be splitting the gym into four teams to give it more of a community aspect. On top of that, we will, uh, we will be providing you with ways to hone in on skills to prepare yourself for the Open. So something that we're doing is we're doing weekly workshops starting on the 13th. The 13th will be going over muscle-ups, bar and ring. The 20th, we're gonna dive into handstands. And then the 27th, we're gonna dive into double unders. So we've taken all of those pesky skills that we put off to the side and are putting them into a couple hour long workshops for you to practice and take away from. From there, probably one of the most important things to talk about when it comes to open season is the different divisions that exist and standards, all right? So within the teams, everyone will be judged according to the category that they want to compete in. So there's gonna be an RX and a scaled version. So if you feel pretty confident at kipping pull-ups, muscle-ups, barbell work, all that stuff, RX is gonna be the way to go. But if you feel like there is some stuff that you still need to work on, then feel free to compete in the scaled version. Now, you can't scale certain parts of a workout in RX, the other ones. You have to compete in one division, so that way when it comes to scoring the teams and deciding the winner at the end of the Open, it's a lot easier to determine the point system. Now, standards. In the competitive environment, there's a specific way to count reps. Right, so for example, the air squat is gonna be below parallel, right? That counts as a good rep. Anything above that is gonna be a no rep. So what happens during the open is that everyone gets paired with a judge and that judge watches them work out to make sure that each rep is a good rep and then counts your score to uh, verify that workout. So every week, everyone's gonna have a judge and that's how the teams are going to get scored. So, without further ado, we'll go to a commercial break and we will begin the Notorious Open Draft. Awesome. Hey guys, just a quick reminder, the Pinoe is operational, we're up and running with it. So if you're curious about your resting metabolic rate, your cardiovascular system, your respiratory system, and you want more information on it, feel free to reach out to me or any of the coaches. We can schedule you and get that going. All right, talk to us soon, bye. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is that time for the Notorious Open Draft. The way this is gonna work is we're gonna go through our panel. We're gonna introduce the coaches on each team, the first round, and then we're going to announce the athletes in our team five at a time. So we'll be starting to my right side. Alex will start us off. All right, so the coaches for team three, as you see us here, is going to be myself, Alex, and also Gerardo Jr. And then our third coach is going to be Brittany B. For team one, we have myself, coach Joy, and Anthony. For team four, it will be Sergio, Kate, and Erica. All right, for team two, we're gonna have myself, coach Gabriel, and coach Paulina. All right, now. Oh, I just. Oh, I think. Oh, I was ready. Now, Take it. <laughs> <laughs> now, the first five athletes for team number three will be Marielle L, Zorin M, Robert L, oh, Bobby, <laughs> Ruben D, and Graciela G. Yeah, nice. First five athletes for team one is going to be Matthew M, David M. Robin B, Hanin A, and Peter S. The first five athletes for team four will be Jessica A, Matthew S, 
Luisana A, Marinda K, Alan G. All right. So for team two, the first five athletes are Oliver M, Amanda A, David K, Isaac Muru, and Kathy R. All right. And then the second five athletes for team three are going to be Francis F, Iris S, Sam B, Peter C, and Cesar C. All right. Second five athletes for team one. George D, James M, Nick A, Juan M, and Brittany C. Welcome aboard. Next set of five for team four will be Dragon M, Harry F, Frank N, Erica O, and Jake S. All right, and the uh, second batch of five for team two is Eddie O, Chris B, Don R, Idris L, and Robin A. I think good. Now the third batch of athletes for team number three will be Milana S, Ibrahim C, Megan P, Amy P, and Brittany B. All right, third wave. Megan M, Karen N, Juan A, Mitko V, and Adam G. Next up for team four, we have Allison H, Jim U, Karen A, Moses E, and Rachel P. Uh, the next five for team two are Jude S, Nico A, Phoebe C, Amy F, and Luisana R. Welcome to the team. Team three, continuing, Reagan A, Paul K, Edgar S, Luis F, and Jacob L. Little, not really young. I was like, I was, I was like, hold on, wait. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, you don't pay enough. <laughs> I, like, I can't be on two teams. your points. <laughs> yeah. All right, fourth wave for team one. Ryan S, George C, Lisa U, Robert K, and Sabrine A. Welcome to team one. Next up for team four, we have Brenda D, Matthew Z, Raul G, Tanya M, and Antonio P. Awesome, so the four way for team two is Maria S, Alex M, Elaine E, Christian M, and Rosalina F. Welcome to team two. And the next wave for team number three will be Roy U, Krista J, Mike G, and Susie B. Looks like a winning team. Yeah. What about when you guys are second place? <laughs> That's cute. That's really cute. Final wave for team one and the all-star team is complete. <laughs> Sandy B, Nicole F, KJ, and Delena. Welcome aboard. Last set for team four, Joseph B, Jessica G, Tom P, and Kristen S. All right, and to complete team two, it's uh, Scott M, Kate P, Mike M and Angelo, and that completes the team two. Well, all the teams are complete, and might I say they are all pretty stacked. I gotta say, I'm pretty excited to see what comes out of each team and who will come out on top. I think experience will have to do a lot with this. So, you know, the most experienced coaches, you know. Your experience doesn't matter when you're not working out. So you're like, well, we'll see about that. I don't know, you know, the new age is, uh, you know, I'll go all day with the new age. Future is now, now. Man. <laughs> iPhone 12 is a thing. <laughs> you got color TV now. Dude. What? <laughs> all right. Well, 
We'll see you after commercial break for our closing remarks. All right, everyone. Probably one of the most important parts of a fitness routine is your recovery routine. And what would recovery be without proper nutrition? We offer New World Nutrition Protein. It's a local Chicago company. We have their grass-fed whey protein and their organic pea protein blends. Different flavors, they're delicious, they mix really well. All organic ingredients that you can read, not these long, complicated ingredients lists that you typically see on your normal protein. So if you're curious about making good quality protein shakes at home, definitely check them out. We sell them here at the gym. So give it a shot, you got nothing to lose. All right, everyone. Well, thank you so much for tuning in to the draft. The names that we called out here today are based off of attendance in the past few months. So if you did not hear your name, please feel free to reach out to any of the coaches so that we can fit you into a team. Keep an eye out for weekly updates in the form of emails, Facebook posts, all that good stuff. We'll keep informing you about how the team's format is uh, gonna pan out, especially in terms of team captains, team shirts, all that good stuff. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Anything else you guys wanna add? Team two's ready. Let's team go. two's yeah. ready. <laughs> okay. okay, okay, okay. That's cute. <laughs> that's cute. <laughs> Again, guys, the most important thing about the Open is to just have fun with it. It's a competitive setting, but there's no risk. Just have fun, especially with your team, and don't take yourself too seriously. All right, so we'll see you out there.